That stanky smell isn't just terpenes, and this new research is going to blow your mind. We know that two different strains that might have the same dominant terpene often have completely different smells. So what else is contributing to that unique aroma? Breakthrough research just published by Abstracts looked at 31 different samples of ice water hash, and then they characterized them from the most sweet smelling to the most savory smelling. And then they looked at the chemistry of what contributed to those smells. So not just terpenes, but what are the other molecules that give it that unique aroma? And here's what they found. The really sweet smelling varieties often contain this new class of compounds called tropical volatile sulfur compounds, or Tropicana sulfurs for short. So these are your strains like papaya, guava, and tangy. And a lot of that sweet citrusy scent comes from these molecules. On the other side of the spectrum are your really savory smelling varieties like garlic cookies, GMO, and chemdog. These varieties contain a molecule called scatol, which is actually partially responsible for the smell of poop. Yes, poop. But the concentrations found in cannabis are so low that it doesn't smell like poop, it actually kind of just smells savory. There's also additional subsets of compounds that are responsible for the really chemically smell of some varieties or the fruity and floral smell of others. These tend to correlate with strains that are ranked the most sweet, whereas terpenes didn't seem to have any sort of correlation. This new research greatly expands our understanding on cannabis aroma and can help us start to profile cannabis in a more objective way. It can also help us start to predict the aroma based on chemistry alone.